यू विल आस्क मी क्वेश्चन और आई हैव टू कंटिन्यूसली टॉकिंग हेलो आई एम हेलो तुम हाथ मून के पी जाओ जिंदगी फैसर एक मिनट <laughs> ये वाली लाइन याद नहीं है गाय टेक टू एक मिनट है टेक थ्री बस आख मूंद के लिसन ए तुम लोग जाओ ना पीछे से टेक फोर सो माय एक्सपीरियंस इन एपी वाज टोटली अ अ मोर टू थिंक कैन यू गिव मी वन मिनट या तुम्हारे शहर का मौसम बड़ा सुहाना लगे मैं एक शाम चुरा लूँ अगर बुरा न लगे तुम्हारे बस में अगर है तो भूल जाओ मुझे मुझे भुलाने में शायद तुम्हें ज़माना लगे ये शेर जो है जाफरी साहब का अजीम प्रेम जी यूनिवर्सिटी की कैंपस लाइफ और बेंगलोर के मौसम पे बहुत ज़्यादा मेल खाता है एक तरफ तो खूबसूरत माहौल जहाँ पर अलग तरह के लोगों से हमें बात करने का मौका मिलता है उनके साथ समय गुजारने का मौका मिलता है दूसरी तरफ बेंगलोर का सुहाना मौसम इस पर चार चांद लगा देता है तो कभी कभी ऐसा होता है कि हम ऐसा स्पेस चाहते हैं जहाँ पे सिर्फ हम बैठ सकें अपना टाइम स्पेंड कर सकें कभी कभी अकेले कभी कभी दोस्तों के साथ यहाँ पे दिल चाहता है रहने का अपने साथ दोस्तों के साथ टाइम स्पेंड करने का so i've had a very narrow experience i studied in the school in the same school for 12 years all my schooling basically but then after coming to apu seeing a lot of students from different backgrounds socially economically i my perspective of india broadened so now i don't judge people basically i was very judgmental in the beginning now i'm very open to lots of ideas and i see people as individuals more than stereotyping with where they come from or where they belong for me uh this space was uh, a learning space uh, in all means because uh, i think that uh, for a student there is no divide between i don't know where is the divide lies between personal or academic for a student everything is a platform for learning so i get that space here so i enjoy it I think it's quite diverse. Uh, you you will you'll see students here from all age group. Uh, there are people who have come here after 10 years of experience. There are people who are fresh graduates. And I think this is a place which gives you a space to talk uh, in a uniform manner to all the people. In the first semester, I feel like I'm not mean to be here because I am like I came from the backward college where the attendance is not important where the lecture is not important and here everything is very vast very important and you need to focus reading and other things you need to ca- catch faculty for learning but from this to now i learned many things i now i confidently say yeah i can stand in any place i can say anything in front of anyone i don't have that fear to speak earlier i had it background and uh, i had exposure about uh, computer languages and all computer related study but when i shift to education uh, whole things uh, was new like fr- from the uh, from the sociology of education philosophy of education whole the pedagogy and curriculum was new for me but uh, the professor taught us from the scratch or the be- beginning they uh, that the thing motivated me and helped me to uh to study more and uh, to uh, learn uh, each uh, every each thing or new thing every day the course follows an interdisciplinary approach so it helps us to address why and how questions uh, apart from what of law and also with regard to classroom we are coming to class with the prayer readings and the classroom becomes an open space for debate so during my 11th and 12th i was uh, i chose humanities so i was really inclined towards the subject and apu had a perfect combination of philosophy history 
and literature, so I thought it would be perfect for me to study and explore my interest further and to narrow it down. Theatre was something that was new for me that I found a little late, but that brings out a lot of different aspects of yourself that you never know that they were in, in you. And I think uh, BA courses like uh, Creativity and Pedagogical Practices, there is this one course and it actually involves a lot of exercises that make you a performer. So I think uh, whatever I did in the theatre club uh, has definitely impacted on me and as a teacher also it will have a big impact is what I think, yeah. Apart from the structure and the environment over here, I think one of the very important thing which I would like to mention is the, uh, the peer support program by the Conversations team. So peer supports are basically, they train you for like three months, okay, they kind of make you understand uh, how mental health issues affect your academic life. Then the peer supporters contact details and everything is passed around the students. So I feel that is something which I really liked about uh, this campus and how they're dealing with mental health. Um, initially, when I read about the curriculum of Masters in Public Policy and Governance, uh, one thing which motivated me was the ground uh, or the grassroots uh, exposure which is given in this particular course. While public policy is considered to be a field where data is heavily, it's a data driven field, but uh, the course ensured that students are sensitized towards social realities as well. और पिछले दो सालों में जो भी यादें हमारे साथ बनी हैं, तो मुझे ऐसा लगता है कि आने वाली जिंदगी भर, जब हम उनको सोचेंगे, तो सिर्फ सोचने से हम पूरे एक ऐसे माहौल में चले जाएंगे जहां हम सुकून पा सकेंगे। हालांकि अब जा रहे हैं दो साल पूरे होने को आए हैं, लेकिन फिर भी कहीं दिल यही कहता है, अभी ना जाओ One thing um, I can, I can sustain throughout my life is the kind of some of my friends I got from APU. It's completely have different perspective, dif different religions, but the bond we created just in between one year is very good. Uh, the facility provided by APU is somehow somehow helped it. We are all from same hostel. The class timings are all same, same, so we are roaming around the campus, going back to the hostel at the same time. In one sense, I can say more than studies, this bond is best thing happened in my life in AP. So I think uh, giving autonomy to uh, kids is very important. Uh, I got the autonomy to uh, do whatever is good for me here and now I realize what is good for me and what is not and and right now I think I'm I'm independent and and I can lead my life without any other help hereafter and I came with lesser confidence but I'm going out with a lot of confidence and that itself is a big takeaway for me. I developed as an individual more than the knowledge I gained I was able to put in my opinions first so I didn't get the space anywhere so Giving my opinion itself was a big deal for me. The biggest learning, uh, I will say, uh, this university taught us how to be human being and uh, how, uh, should, how we have to uh, uh, tackle the situation with the, uh, positively. There are challenges in social sector, but this uni university gave me insights how to deal with that situation and challenges with positive. Yeah, positive.